Hello everyone, in this video you will see how you can set up your Google Tag Manager with Go High Level platform and then how you can set up Google Analytics for lead tracking. Go High Level is very popular nowadays and it has tons of options, functionalities for automation, for running a sales business. This video will be very informative for you. This is Jubar Mahmood. I am a proprietor seller in Upwork in web analytics and tracking field. So if you are a business owner, if you are a web analytics expert who want to tracking set up for their client and give the value. So this video is for you. So without any further delay, let's get into the video. So I am in my computer screen. So our fastest test is to set up our Google Tag Manager container for our Go High Level. So we already have an account. So we are right now creating a new container for our go high level so at first i have to click the create container and the container name section i am giving a specific name you can rename it whatever you want it select the target platform that is for me is web then click the create create option top right corner so our google tag manager container has been created so after creating our container you will get two types of code one you can paste into the head section and another is you can place it into body section so we have to go into our ghl platform and where we can add this html code so at first go into the site section into your go high level platform and then go into any other funnel that that funnel you want to track so just go into this funnel that funnel selected funnel and after that there is a setting option you just click it and scroll down and here you can find a head tracking code and body tracking code so you have to just copy your head tracking code here and paste it over this uh, head section and it will add the html code into the your funnel head section and after that you just go into google tag manager and select your body tracking code and paste it over your body section and scroll down all the way down and there is a save option just save it yes successfully our google tag manager has uh, connected so we want to debug that our google tag manager has uh, properly connected or not we want to track this uh, lead funnel we will do a preview from here you can test from here if you paste your website url and do it select option it will show a green tick if it connected and another way we can do a preview from here just preview it and paste your url and connect it's showing that our gtm is connected properly another short update if you want to be a web analytics and tracking expert and set up tracking for your client sell your service in freelance marketplace so uh, we have an amazing community that's name is growth academy we have a advanced course module that is web analytics and tracking course and app tracking course as well i'll leave all the details into my video description do check it out our community right now our google tag manager is connected with our ghl platform our next step is connect uh, track the lead tracking for ga4 for that we have to connect our google analytics with google tag manager for that we have to go into the data collection and data stream select your data stream just copy your measurement id create a new tag then tag configuration click that then click select the google analytics 4 and select the google tag g tag and paste your measurement id here then trigger it all the page then you have to uh, save this tag with, then we'll create a, another tag select the new and then google analytics 4 and select the google analytics 4 event right now paste your measurement id here google tag has found in the container event name generate lead after setting our event name into our ga4 tag and then we'll test our lead form so we can build our trigger into our google tag manager there is a thank you page so set up a trigger here select the new trigger and there is a we will select the trigger name lead trigger 
select the trigger trigger configuration page view page url content there is the thank you for your opt-in this is coming in the url so we'll select it that url paste it our thank you url and save it we have to rename our tag name is gf for lead tag then we have to save and after that if we preview that again check that our google uh, lead tracking is currently working or not we just do a preview from here you scroll down all the way down and fill up our form we have done the fill up and select the consent submit the stack our gfo lead track is firing because our thank you page is loaded it's firing so our the step is completed how we can connect our google analytics 4 with google tag manager and we can we can did the lead tracking for our gfo tracking and we can take the from data from enhanced conversion as well because i have the code we can inherit the user details for our enhanced tracking there's some other code we can do for our email phone number and the username for our enhanced google s conversion tracking that's the advanced part so we'll not cover it this video but if you want any kind of this service i can help you to set up that so after that our lead is successfully firing in here after setup the lead tracking for ga4 we do a submit because our lead tracking is perfectly working but if we test it again if it is working properly or not we will we want to see that into the to the debug view at first do a preview option paste your website url and if we scroll down all the way down and there is the form i am just type some random details in here our thank you page has been initiated you can see our generate lead event is already fired in here it's showing that our generate lead is already into the debug mode you can see it's coming our thank you page is loaded we have the variable we can fire the user email username user phone number that's the advanced tracking with the custom javascript we can do that if you need this service you can inbox me uh, i'll set up that for your business this advanced tracking has done for another client so we have already covered everything into this video that how you can set up your google tag manager with go high level then how you can set up the lead tracking for ga4 so if you find anything informative in this video please do a subscribe and like this video so that's all for today's video in this video you have learned how you can set up your google tag manager with the go high level platform and how you can set up generate lead and lead tracking for your google analytics 4 ga4 platform google ad conversion tracking as well this same method so if you get value from this video please do subscribe and support our channel Till then, take care, goodbye and tata.